From beauty queen to queen of pulp fiction, Shobha Day has come a long way. After delivering a string of best-selling novels, Day has now moved to non-fiction, writing a newly released autobiography titled Selective Memories. It's non-fiction. For another, it's about my own life. I'm not creating characters. I am the character in the book. And I've written about several people who have influenced me, my own experiences, uh, the kind of things that have shaped my life and which have made me who I am today. Considering her long years as a columnist, non-fiction writing comes naturally today. What has taken people by surprise, however, is the fact that she has decided to write her autobiography at a relatively young age. The new book is uh, a memoir. I thought the country turned 50 and I turned 50, so it was an ideal moment for me to write a book of this kind. It's non-fiction. I've been overwhelmed by the sort of reactions I've received to it. And I'm glad I wrote it. Shobha Day is now taking a short break before she starts her next book. But she has other things up her sleeve as well. I can't think beyond writing and don't wish to. I have two future um, script projects for next year and a film project which I am seriously considering and more writing. While Shobha Day gets ready to confront a future, selective memories of her past is all set to evoke mixed reactions from her critics in the present.